as a co-star i think he's extremely driven and focused as a friend i'd say he's he's one of my closest friends in the industry he's full of life he's he's always fun to be around my 25 minute role in uh last story is what really made people see the actor in me in shersha the way it impacted me in the narration i felt like if it has the same impact on people then that would mean something to me at the time we thought we release it the pandemic happened so now finally it's coming out there's excitement there's a lot of excitement actually to be honest hi this is kiara advani and you're watching me on e time So Kiara, welcome to E Times. Should I call you Kiara or should I call you Dimple? <laughs> Whatever you like to call me, my director still calls me Dimple. Oh, so that's amazing. <laughs> so Kiara, first of all, congratulations. The trailer looks good. It's getting positive response from all the quarters, and also the film is finally coming out. So how does it feel? I mean, finally, the end product is reaching to the audience on August twelfth. so what what is the uh, feeling right now all so excited kyunki we've been waiting for 2 years to share this film with everyone and you know we at the time we thought we release it the pandemic happened so now finally it's coming out there's excitement there's a lot of excitement actually to be honest yeah. okay and like uh, if we talk about the release date like i just mentioned it was supposed to release 2 years back like in 2020 and 2019 but uh, it got it got postponed several times so do you think like the maker should have waited for a theater release or do you think the ott release is apt for the current situation uh, we did wait for a theatrical release but then given the current situation it's all. we have to be practical and then of course when you know that you know through ott and through amazon prime video we will be reaching many more screens and we would have been able to theatrically i felt like that became a you know a driving force to say let's go ahead because it's a story that we wanted to put out there and we wanted people to know and then we wanted people even crossing borders to know and you know all over to know because it's it's such a really, it's it's just such an inspiring story right so yeah talking about your character you play vikram batra's fiance uh, in the film how easy or difficult it was for you emotionally and like you met dimple chima uh, before starting the shoot for this film so how was that process of getting her mannerisms and that punjabi accent so yeah tell me about that i mean it is very emotional it was also very intriguing because when i read the script i just wanted to know more about her and um, i was very fortunate that i got to meet her before we shot so that i could you know i could just feel those emotions that sentiment that that so that i had to pick up and i just instantly connected to her the story everything that she shared um because everything in the film is authentic and is as per what happened and we've kept it you know sir vishnu sir who's the director has kept it as real as it was and has kept every scene and every moment between them Mm. uh you know that actually happened in the film so there's nothing that's been uh just made up or whatever it's all very very authentic right. and um i think for me the only the only thing was to keep it as be as honest and portray her um as honestly as i could without taking that you know that pressure of oh my god she's going to see the film but that was there you know that was there behind like today i'm i'm waiting for that moment that I want to know how she feels when she sees the film. Oh, they haven't seen the film yet. Dimple has seen the trailer. She's not seen the film yet. And even Vikram Batra's Captain Vikram Batra's family is uh, going to see the film very soon. Okay. So for all of us, it's that's very special, and we're waiting for that moment uh, <laughs> because it's going to be a very emotional watch for, of course, for the family and for Dimple. Right. Uh, waiting for that, yeah. So, how much do you resonate to Dimple in real life? Like in the trailer, we saw that she's fighting against all odds to marry her love. Uh, so, like, do you resonate with that quality of Dimple in real life? Like, absolutely. Will you do something like that if you uh, are uh, if you are in that situation by any chance, hypothetically? I think when you're in love, and if you if you're lucky to to be in love the way they were. and to have that kind of love in your life then 
you it's you know these all these conflicts you that strength comes within you to mm-hmm. fight for that and that's what she did i think she's a very strong personality herself she's somebody who did like you rightly said fought all odds um you know to make this relationship uh work i mean it, of course between her and captain vikram patel there was not but just given his um his professional career given her having to fight against it with you know like any normal girl with your family all those things that happen all those conflicts i think she really stood and stayed strong through it all mm-hmm. and that in that sense i think i would definitely uh you know give her full credit for being that person and you know for being so strong um but i think what for me what really connected with me was her commitment to love and i feel that's how i am also as a person so that's something i could relate with her reason for marriage was love and that's why she chose to remain unmarried right um, and i feel for me also my reason for marriage would always be love and that's something that that was a quality between her and i that uh that made it that just instantly made me connect with the story and with her so like, talking about your co-star kiara siddharth you are working uh, with him for the first time and the fans are quite excited to watch you guys in the film so yeah. how would you describe siddharth as a co-star and as a friend <clears throat> as a co-star i think he is extremely driven and focused you know he loves to he loves to prep a lot and do a lot of readings and uh, that's very that's very similar to the way i like to work on a film so in that sense we got along very well we mm-hmm. uh, with vishnu so and sandeep so the writer so there was a lot of readings and prepping and you know really getting all the nuances of, of both uh, the people we were playing correct as a friend i'd say he's he's one of my closest friends in the industry so i think uh, i think through the film as a, i think even as a friend he's you know he's he's full of life he's always fun to be around talking about the screen time so kiara i just wanted to know your thoughts how much does screen time matter fa- uh, factor matters while signing a film uh, you know, an example of the fact that it doesn't matter to me because my 25 minute role in uh, last stories is what really made people mm-hmm. see the actor in me right and i feel like it's very important how impactful the role is you know and it's always a choice you know it 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 depends whether you want to what what your reasons are for doing a particular film right is in shersha the way it impacted me in the narration i felt like if it has the same impact on people then that would mean something to me so i just it impacted me really dearly in the narration and i was left thinking about this part of the story and about him for a very long time and about dimple for a very long time after her in the narration so i knew that that is something that uh, you know there was a part of the story that that was very very special okay and speaking about your journey kiara you recently completed 7 years in the industry and currently you are everywhere you are doing a pan india film with ram charan you have a, a great lineup ahead so how does it feel to be in a busy space like do you want do you always wanted your career to shape up like this i mean yeah i feel like i always wanted to be working with you know the people i'm working with today or the directors i'm working with and there's a long list of people i'm looking forward to working with right. um but i think also just being offered the kind of roles i am being offered today it um it's very exciting as an actor to uh you know to keep doing different roles and not get typecast and yeah. when directors come to you with different roles it's it's interesting because sometimes even you don't see yourself in some of those roles but they have that confidence in you mm-hmm. and that that automatically gives you the confidence even when i did a guilty or when i did whichever even like a monica from good news yeah. all these roles i feel like it was i give full credit to these directors who who had that faith that i would pull it off because they the roles that the films that they had seen of mine before you know they they were very different right. so I'm, i'm happy that you know i've been able to prove my versatility as an actor and i've been getting some interesting roles to portray in the in the last couple of months years and even the ones that i'm doing now so yeah it's a great time to be an actor in the industry okay thank you so much kiara it was a pleasure talking to you and all the very best for shesha i'm looking forward to the film thank you so much
and i hope we meet soon in person yes, for sure this for situation sure. gets better all the best thank you lots of love